Hi everyone and welcome to Fusion 360 Monthly Challenge 2019. Joining the challenge is very easy. All you have to do is forward your full name, school or company name together with your Fusion 360 email to Autodesk Community Philippines at gmail.com. Welcome to August Fusion 360 Monthly Challenge. In this challenge, I am seeing a swept feature. And the challenge here specifically revolves on creating the sweep path. Let's head to Fusion 360. Before we enter sketch mode, let's head up to our profile. So here, I'm going to select Autodesk Education, going to Preferences, adding to Design, and I want you to enable Allow 3D Sketching of Lines and Splines. Selecting the checkbox, hitting Apply and OK. Let's directly enter sketch mode. I'm going to hit L for line. And let's sketch on our XZ plane. Left click here. I am seeing a line in the length of 100. So creating a horizontal line here. Keying in 100, hitting Enter. Notice the inferred horizontal constraint. Next, let's grab our midpoint constraint to move this horizontal line to our origin. So selecting this horizontal line, holding control, left click our origin, right click, and select midpoint. And because we enabled allow 3D sketching, on our preferences, notice here, 3D sketch is enabled. So if not, enable this. Let's head to home view, zooming out, hitting escape to disable the constraint. Let's create another line, hitting L, and let's drop our first point on this end point, moving down. So notice, when the X, Y, Z axis appears, we are in 3D sketch mode. Let's key in 50, hitting enter. Next, hit L once more, dropping our first point at this end point. So notice the X, Y, Z axis. Let's key in 50 once more, hitting enter. Let's orbit around to check, hitting L once more creating a line from this endpoint. Once more, notice the triad, keying in 50, hitting L once more, dropping our first point at this endpoint. Notice once more the X, Y, Z axis, key in 50, hitting enter. Let's head to top view to check. Looking nice, right view, and finally head back to home view. In addition, let's add fillet to our corners. So hitting S for sketch shortcuts, typing F-I-L-L, -L, selecting fillet, selecting this points, left click here, key in, then hitting enter, repeat the procedure. Right click, selecting repeat fillet, moving to this corner, hitting enter, repeating the procedure, going to this corner, hitting enter, moving up, or sliding my right mouse button up to repeat the command, selecting this corner, hitting enter, so ignore the warning. Fillets applied, we can now select Finish Sketch. Our next intent is to create the sketch profile, which is a circle. But first, we need to have a construction plane. So let's head up to Construct, select Plane Along Path, selecting this path. Let's move this arrow to the left. And to be exact, let's key in 1. Hitting enter. Let's now create our circular profile. So hitting C for circle. 
Now we are prompted to select a plane. Selecting this newly created plane, let's drop our center point at this end point. The diameter to be 10. Hitting enter. Selecting finish sketch. Hitting S for design shortcuts and typing S W E E. Selecting sweep. For the profile, selecting our circular profile, activating our path, and making sure chain selection is enabled. Selecting this path, operation, new body, and hit OK. Going to home view. And that's the technique for quickly creating the August Fusion 360 monthly challenge. Let us know how you created the challenge in the comment section below. Thanks for watching and congratulations for completing the August Fusion 360 monthly challenge. This video is sponsored by MSI Workstations. Fusion 360 works smoothly with MSI Workstation. Join us in Facebook. See you in the next Fusion 360 monthly challenge.